Looking forward, I think ordin ordinarily when you look at a huge club, you think to yourself, you don't want to be the one to follow the one. Two examples, Manchester United to Alex Ferguson. When he left, you didn't be the, want to be the one following him. Not just because of the, the size of him at the club, but what he was leaving behind. Some great players, but a lot of them were coming towards the end of, this, of their careers. Some of them weren't necessarily wanted anymore. Same with Arsene Wenger at Arsenal. What we've seen with this Liverpool team with Klopp is that he's actually rebuilt this team. He's rebuilt this team. He's moved away from the likes of Firmino, from the likes of Mane, from the likes of Henderson, from Fabinho. Great players that they've had that have gone. He's now rebuilt a team that's ready to go again. And this is, this is sort of extraordinary when, when a big manager leaves a club. So the next manager that comes in, he has the opportunity to actually hit the ground running. I mean, it's a really good point that Danny makes. And, 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 and I get that, you know, there's so many good bits in place. But I want to go back to Jurgen Klopp who is a unique, almost exceptional individual, who's at, who's at the centre of everything that happens at, at Anfield and the way he manages, the way he hugs, the, the way he gets on at fourth officials, the way he gets the fans in the game, the motivation for, for his teammates, the, the, the lack of... Uh, the, the belief that he puts in this team. I saw a really great line yesterday where it was said that Liverpool won this game because of the qualities of Jurgen Klopp, because he just wouldn't allow them not to win it. Doesn't matter who's injured and all the big players on the bench. Doesn't matter that his kids out of the academy. It's about Jurgen Klopp and his team. And so to just add another line to Danny's line, uh, line is that, yes, it's all set up for someone, but you've got to be a very special person to continue it on the path that it's been going. I mean, what do you think of that, Danny? Because that, that compelling argument that the players are there, the cupboard yeah. is not bare, but how much of this is Jurgen Klopp this season and how much can they sustain it going yeah, forward? Jurgen Klopp's obviously been a huge part of the football club. He's going to go down as a, as a legend up there with the best of them. There's no question about it. But I think when I look at Jurgen Klopp, when he said that he's leaving in the summer he's probably starting to lose energy now. He's probably starting to feel the effects of it because he is 100, 100 miles an hour. It's as simple as that. So what they need now, what it enables them to do, it enables them to go and look for a manager because the squad is in place. Mm -hmm. It gives Liverpool the opportunity to say, right, OK, which manager fits the way that Jurgen Klopp plays the best? I'm not saying there's going to be a manager that's like for like, it, but it's not about, right, which manager we're going to come in and we're going to give £200 million to or however much it is to try and rebuild this team. That's one less thing that they have to do. Staying in the present, they've hoisted one trophy mm -hmm. so far. You think they, uh, they hoist another, maybe three more? Jurgen Klopp, uh, my, my phrase is there's going to be a, a day in May in Liverpool when Jurgen Klopp's on a, a, a double-decker bus and he's going to be lifting one piece of silverware. And I think yesterday and that, that win in that manner has put the fire under Liverpool to make it three more titles and take the four. I, I don't think they get all four. I, I'm, I'm thinking two or three are possible. But I tell you, oh. that was a, was, was a real great performance by the team. Farewell season. tour. Pretty good start to the <laughs> yeah. farewell tour. Yeah. Hi there, I'm Rebecca Lowe, studio host for NBC's coverage of the Premier League. Don't forget to hit subscribe to watch more videos all season long. And for even more Premier League content, from original series to live matches, head over to Peacock. And be sure to tune in for Premier League mornings every weekend on USA Network and on Peacock. We will see you there.